are you going to this sort of the artificial intelligence thing yes, this afternoon? Yes, I am, yes. It's quite creepy, it's isn't it? About, I don't know, actually. I don't know. Because, the, I mean, there is this sort of theory that we make computers more and more intelligent and, and so we then allow computers to do the things that we normally do, like fishing and stuff like that. And eventually we'll start making computers that can do things that we can't do. Right. Like come up with the opposite of the word placard. And then suddenly computers become so intelligent that we'll die out. I mean, that's the theory. But I think that is bollocks. Because I think what will happen is they'll make computers that are like human beings. But if they are like human beings, then mm. fundamentally they'll be lazy mm. and they'll want to get other things to do the jobs that they don't want to do, like men. And what they'll do is they'll breed men that can remember things and take notes for them, and they'll have little laptop men, and it'll be the craze for computers to think, um, oh, let's come up with a, a more efficient way of booking cheap flight tickets. And what will happen is you'll have computers with men strapped to the front of them that um, shout to men attached to the front of travel agent computers. And then what will happen is they'll invent a man that's more intelligent than computers. And then what will happen is this man will be enormous and computers will die out. So everything will be back to the way it is, except that men will be 50 feet high and we'll all kill each other in a nuclear holocaust. But that's not the point. The point is we're in control of our own destiny.